Hello guys, welcome to the first ever episode of Army Men of War, a series that I'm going to be doing exclusively on my channel. So be sure to hit that subscribe button and please do hit that like button as well. Anyway, let's click the continue button. So, in this series, um, we are focusing mainly from the Green's perspective under the command of Commander Green, which is in, he's inside here if you want to yes, see him. Sir. Let's get him out. There we go, there's Commander Green and he's also got his other officer in there at the minute. And in the series, w what's happened so far is, this is the Greens' territory, within this like fence sort of thing. So this garden is their territory. And what is, the Tans have made a big hole in their fence. And they are going to be advancing into their territory. So let's have a little watch. So we're sending two platoons of Green soldiers out into the, um, into the grass. Which kind of resembles like a sort of jungle, if you ask me. So we, we consist of many riflemen, many flamethrowers, and many SMGs. So let's just see what happens. Yeah, a bit like Vietnam, really. Who knows what's going to happen. So they're approaching on foot, mainly. We do have a big line of troops back there, which I'll show you in a minute. But we just need to try and get to this gap in the fence and see what happened. Because they just don't know what happened. All that they know is there's a big explosion. And they just don't know what it was. Oh, crap. Ambush. Right, so the greens have been ambushed. We've got, apparently we've got two bunkers. Spraying bullets at them. Absolutely spraying bullets at them. And some tan soldiers just appeared out of nowhere. So we're going to just see how this plays out. So this is the first episode first episode of this awesome mod that I've just made. I'm really excited to play it and I think it really works for it. Oh, look at the flames. It's awesome. Oh, careful you don't melt. Don't melt, guys. That's completely crap. So that was a huge ambush. Like, ambush that happened. So we've got to be really careful how many men that we use. So what we're going to do is now, let's just give you a quick showcase of where whilst they're advancing down there, we've got to keep our command bunker intact with our commander. And we also have some building pads, so we're going to be building some um, structures. And yes, that means base building in Men of War, guys. Base building in Men of War. So what we're going to do is we're going to get our engineers. And we're going to come over here and we're going to build a plastic factory. So we'll take the engineers here. And only engineers can do that, believe it or not. So, Alright, so building plastic factory is going to take 25 seconds. So we've got to wait for that. And in the meantime, we're going to build a, we'll build a tower as well. So I have implemented like a script where you can make bases, which is really, really cool. So the Greens are really going to try and defend their land now. They're going to stop the Tan forces coming from the north, which is where their house is and where their garden is. So we're going to try and stop them from taking our house. Oh, there we go. Our factory's built. So now we can build green tanks and also some green squads. We can also build our tower as well, which comes with a machine gunner. So let's, let's just keep sending troops out there. Let's build a green tank. We're going to try and push our men forward as much as we can. It's It's horrifying. It's terrible. I've got a lot of infantry moving up on us. We need, really need to push our men forward. All right, let's get another engineer to build this tower right here. And like I said, I, do, I have no idea what the outcome is going to be. Um, what, what the outcome is going to be like. So whatever the outcome is will affect the next episode. So, yeah. Right, so we're just going to move some troops up there, not those ones, we can keep them back. But we're going to keep throwing troops out there if we can. I think how many troops do we have? We have 18 green tanks and we have 19 green squads available. So we've got a lot of men we can play with. But I'm really, really going to try and make this battle interesting. We're going to use this plane for us for our advantage. Because none of the troops have grenades, you see. We haven't researched grenades yet, until very early stage in the war. But, oh! We really need to take the grass out, so we can see the, the um, tank board. It's really hard actually, a lot better than last time. Burn them! Burn those motherfuckers! Right, silhouettes, I hate the silhouettes. Right, we're going to push our tanks forward now, we're going to see, see if we can hold them back. Like there, you know, that Push forward. Oh, we've got tank disabled. Alright, I think we're doing quite well. We're going to try and reserve. Get as many reserves as we can. We're just going to use our men as wisely as we can. 
So we're kind of counter offensing their, um, their offensive. Does that make sense? That makes no sense. Um, yeah, we're just going to launch a counter offensive again. So, what, let's see what the tanks have. We have some light tanks and a lot of infantry by the looks of things. And also the bunkers. So, we're really going to try and push forward and take those bunkers from them. And we're going to use these pop tanks for our bandages to get in there. Try and hold them into this. Bit of a no man's land. I think it's a good shot. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, okay. no, no. never mind. Never mind. All right. So what we're going to do is now we're going to keep advancing our soldiers. We're going to keep getting them out if we can. Really try and push them back to the fence. We got him? I thought we got him that time. Got him. Alright. Get you guys come. Push forward. Yes, sir. Got it, sir. Got it, sir. Okay. Proper we're we'll proper launching an offense here. So we can push them back to their yes, fence. Sir. This tank seems to be pinned, so there's one guy in there, so we'll just fix it. Oh, we've got some tan heavy tanks in here now. Tan heavy tanks, so we're gonna try and counter their heavy tank with a heavy tank. Let's do this. We'll get these in some better cover. Use the little pop dogs, okay? Oh, that's a flamethrower. That's it. Hold him there. So we can wait for an ambush. Right, run. Do it. You can do it. You can do this. Flame him. Oh, whoa. Bad idea. Very bad idea. I'm so sorry for this thing. So, so sorry. Alright, so we can keep the soldiers up. Use their tanks as cover. Okay. Oh, nice one, yeah. It's going to be a tough one, this. A very tough one. Yep, so we're going to keep throwing men out there. We've got a lot of them back here. Let's have a look what we've got back here. We have a Jeep. We have a bow force. Um, it's like an anti-tank, anti-aircraft. We also have heavy artillery. And we have a few tanks as well, so we've got quite a strong like, defensive line. So we're going to try and hold them off as much as we can. Very good job at the minute. And this is the first episode of this series, guys. So like I say, the outcome determines whether the tanks win or the demons win. So I have no idea who's going to win. That's been a war. It's very random. Very, very yes, random. Right, we're going to move these guys up. See what we've See if we make a flanking move near the um, the great barrels. Got a lot of soldiers advancing. A hell of a lot of soldiers. Whoa! That was a good shot. That was a damn good shot. Alright, they're pushing a bit too close to our front line here. So we're just going to bring some more soldiers out. And we don't want the tans getting too close to any of our structures because they will set them on fire and destroy them. Which will, then we'll lose our ability to recruit any more soldiers. So we keep pushing our men out. We're going to take this plane for it. The plane for it works really well, you see. Getting down. Really trying to push him for Oh, maybe not. Bad idea. Another bad idea. I'm a terrible general. I think I'll just leave them alone now. Oh, another brilliant shot. Right, so we have a lot of tan forces around. I think we'll just have some more coming as well. Yeah, we've got some more coming in right now. 
Uh, they are back with a heavy tank, a light tank. I think, is that about 30, maybe 40 infantry, something like that? Something like that. Right, we're not doing too well. We're not doing very well on this one. Right. We'll keep pushing men up. We ain't going to last much longer. We really need to defend our house. This is our house. We cannot let the tanks take it. That kid from across the road, he cannot have our house. Our troops are more dominant than that. Get out of there. No. Terrible idea again. I'd say I'm a terrible general. But I'm not the general. The general's in here, look. The general is safe and sound in his bunker. We get him on the front line to inspect. You're doing a great job, boys. You're doing a very good job. That's good. Moving up here. Inspect this. You're doing a very good job. Get back in there. Get back in there. Good shot. Oh, there we go. Right, awesome. I apologise if the sound quality is a bit off tonight, guys, but I am having to play through my monitor because um, my headset seems to be broken. So I'm having to play all the sounds through my monitor, but my mic seems to work still, which is quite cool. So if you don't hear any sound, I will fix that. I will fix it in the next so This is the best I can really get it. So we're going to keep getting some more men up. We're going to get another green tank up. We've got loads of green tanks. But that's because this is our home, isn't it? Of course we're going to have a lot of heavy heavy weaponry. We only use the best when it comes to our home. Right, let's see if we get some good shots for the hot. Oh, maybe not. I've taken ages to load. These cannons seem to be doing a really good job. Really holding them back. Destroying the light tank as well. <laughs> Just look at that. That's like a tank graveyard. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. Another heavy tank moving up. Oh, we definitely need to flank them. I'm going to try and flank them right now. How many tanks do we have left? We've got 16 green squads and we've got 14 tanks. Plenty, 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 plenty. Let's keep getting them out there if we can. But they seem to be getting a bit of a foothold in the middle now, so we're going to try and break that foothold with our tanks. So we get a squad of tanks there, we'll get a squad there. So we'll get a tank there even, not a squad. And then we'll get another tank next to it. See if we can push them with just two tanks. I think all these tanks here are just safe. We're pushing with the light tanks there. Oh, they're so close again, they're getting so close. Nah, not much longer there. Tanks are safe a little bit, so I think so. Oh, we've got, we've got our two tanks now, we're going to do our flanking. We're going to push the flank, looks like we've got some strays in the grass over there. Yeah, you guys will have to tell me what you want to see in the series. You have to spam me with comments in the comment section. We'll just um, we'll try and work out a really good series this way. Make a really good story. I've got quite a good story as it is, but I need more ideas. So ideas for maps, all sorts really. Just tell me what you want to see in the comments. Oh, great. Oh, look at these. I just love this ground. Look at the ground. It just looks so awesome. You've got a house in the background. It looks epic. Right. So now, now is the time. We're going to launch a counter offensive now. Get more tanks out there. We're really going to spam, spam units now. Okay. We've got to keep them away from our factory. We're going to keep getting units. Uh, we'll use our flamethrowers wisely if we can. Flatten this grass. There we go. Whoa! I love how to blow up, that's so cool. I can't feel the detection there. Use the metal, use the cover. I think I've made the Greens very OP, but this is their homeland, guys. So you've got them, this is where they live. So the Greens are going to have a lot of men, a hell of a lot of men. And the Thames are just launching with a handful of their soldiers. 
It looks like an army, to be honest, but this is just, just going to be a fraction. Just a fraction of the Tan forces. The Tans have a big house. You say we live, the Greens, they live in a little house. The Tans, they live in a mansion, which is over there. I'm not going to show you in this episode, but I'll show you in a few clips. It sounds like they're retreating now, they seem to be falling back, but we're going to really try and push them forward with more squads. So we've got 14 squads available, lots and lots of men. But like I say, if they got as close as the plastic factory, I'd lose those men. So I wouldn't have any reinforcements if they got as close as the uh, plastic factory. The car that tank's made of plastic, I don't think it's going to be Oh, go for it. Look, this tank has got Rambo. Rambo tank. Really doing well with this uh, Oh, dude! Whoa! Right, let's do this. Let's continue the flank. Oh no, he's disabled. You've got a disabled tank. That's it. Let's get a good shot here of him running up. Bunkers to say that, yep, the bunkers are. Uh... Oh, we're not advancing any further, get down the tank. Hold your position. Right, so now we have a foothold where they had a foothold just like three minutes ago. So we can bring up as many men as we can. Uh, that artillery piece is doing really well. Really, really well. So we've got a bunker there which we're going to take out. Let's see if we can get a hero. Just right on them. They all have different weapons. They've got like carbines, M1 Grand, and Everyone's got different weapons. We're going to use this guy and we're going to try and pick off that bunker if we can. Okay. Covering fire! Right, we're going to get the tank out of here. Right, so you guys cover him. And you two run across there. Go, 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 go. Oh, maybe not. That was a disaster. An absolute disaster. Right. Move these guys up. We've got a lot of men now. We are pushing them back to the fence. And who knows? Look, look at the gap in the fence now. They've really took us out. Right. Oh, this tank's collected. Let's do this. Come on. Get to the back of the bunker. Get to the back of the bunker. Come on. 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 Come there we go. Forward. Looks like we did it, boys. We did it. We pushed the turn back. Uh, who knows? Maybe, maybe the next episode we'll invade the Tans like, territory. Or who knows? Maybe the Tans the Tans have a lot more soldiers than us. But there is a lot more factions. There's not, there's not just one green faction. Every other house has a green faction as well. And we also have a red faction. We have a question mark faction, which we'll be finding out in the future. And obviously we have the tan faction. Who knows, we can even have the grey faction. Right, let's use this flame for us. Finish these off. Execute the others left over. I think I'll just set fire to one then. Good. I think we did it. I think that's we can wrap that up, guys. I think and call that a win for the Greens. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this new series, the start to this new series, should I say? Please hit that like and subscribe button, and I will see you all in the next one.